With four decks loaded, the Prime 4 screen will look like this. You can pinch and zoom a track waveform view and all tracks respond. Tapping the lower panel switches track time duration to time remaining and this is where the track's musical key is displayed. The active track's timeline can be scrubbed or tapped to quickly needle drop to a new position. A track needs to be paused or needle lock set to off in the preferences. This overview waveform display always shows the active track. Tapping the library icon shows the full music library screen and here you can tap through crates and playlists. Sort by different categories by tapping the sort icon and switch top to bottom ordering with the triangle icon. Tapping the prepare folder icon shows tracks that have been swiped left instead of right to load in readiness for playing later in a set. Tapping the main search icon brings up an on-screen keyboard so you can quickly and easily search through your library. It's also possible to connect a physical USB keyboard to Prime 4 if you prefer. In the next video, we'll explore the Prime 4's mixer functionality.